Okay guys, so if you have watched my video, this is my grand giveaway. I'm so excited to finally be showing you guys everything. Uh, one lucky person will be winning all of this for Christmas. So if you want to know what that's all about, uh, check out my previous video. My giveaway is still going on and I'm so excited. I still have all my items in here <laughs> and one lucky person will be winning all of it and I'm like super, super excited. If you have no idea what I'm talking about, go ahead and check out the video previous to this one or I will have the link to that video down in my description box. That way you can go ahead and check it out. But it is a giveaway. So if you want to know how to enter and how to win, just go ahead and click on it. Yeah, anyways, hello. Hello everyone, <laughs> welcome back to my channel. This is Smash Brush. So today I am super excited to be able to actually record something. I feel like I've been super inconsistent lately and I do apologize for that. There has just been so much going on, but in about a week or two, you will definitely know why I have. I wanted to record a video on how to create this look right here. Some people may think this is a very complicated look. This is actually a very fast, very easy holiday glam look. We are all like in always such a time crunch some people have to split their times between families. Our time is so limited, so I figured I can show you guys how to create this very quick, glam, and festive look. This is like such an awesome go-to look, not just for like the holidays, but also just in general if you're going out on a weekend. If this is a video that you're interested in, then just keep watching, and without further ado, let's get to it. So before starting, um, there's a couple things I just want to say. One, um, please don't mind my nails. My nails are crazy and I'm doing it this way that way you guys don't like pause it and like see it. If you see my nails looking a little cray, sorry guys. Two, shout out to my mom because this shirt right here, she let me borrow this shirt. Mami, si tu estás mirando este video, gracias por dejarme usar tu polo. <laughs> That's a little bit of my book of Spanish, so. Oh yes, I have also done my foundation, my concealer, contour, and all of that. This video will basically be me showing you how to do a fast holiday eye glam along with a nice lip. Yeah, let's just get right into it. So we're gonna start off with the eyes first, lips at the very end. I am going to be using the Jaclyn Hill Original Palette. It's it's been like a really, really long time. This is like for the first time in like forever. <laughs> for the first time in forever. <laughs> Seriously though, it is, this is like the first time in forever that I've used this palette. So as a base, I'm going to be using the Huda Beauty Overachiever Concealer. Going in with this third color right here, this is the Silk Cream color. I'm gonna be using a blending brush that kinda looks like this. And basically we are just gonna apply this all over our crease area. Okay, this is a little light. So I'm gonna be using this color right over here which is called Pooter. And basically, I'm just gonna go right over it. I mean, you do see like a slight contrast, but I wanted something a little bit stronger than this. I'm going to be using a much smaller blending brush now, and I'm going to be going in with this color right here on the bottom. It is called Central Park. So I'm gonna be using that color just like from the very corner, just to like mid crease. Okay, and then whatever's remaining with that first original fluffy brush, I'm gonna just kind of go over it because this is really gonna help just blend everything together nicely. So now I'm gonna be grabbing this highlight color right here called Beam. And honestly, this is like one of my top favorite like brow highlight colors because it just, I don't know, it's like the perfect amount of sheen, perfect amount of like white in there. So I'm gonna go ahead and just apply it right there and a little bit in my inner corner. See how white that is? Don't worry, it's not gonna stay this bright. <laughs> okay, and then going in with that fluffy brush once again, I'm going to just blend out the edges of this. That way this doesn't look super, super highlighted because right now it is like beaming at you. <laughs> yeah. 
see i'm okay with that and you see how like the dark color kind of like started blending in that was the point i didn't want it to look too harsh just in the corner i want it to be very like nice and blended so next i'm using this very flat brush and i'm going to be using this color called cree from the um huda beauty new nude um, palette and it's just like a very light gold color i know the jaclyn hill does have a gold color in there but that's the only thing i want to say that like I wish they had in that palette was just a lighter gold because they have like a very more deeper intense gold if that makes sense so I'm just gonna go ahead and apply it all over my lid area last thing and this is like the most important product of like this entire look is i'm going to be using the stila glitter and glow liquid glitter and this is in the color gold goddess this i'm telling you even if you let's say didn't have like this kind of gold as long as you put something underneath something like shimmery and bright put this right over and you will get that nice gold tone and i feel like i haven't used this on like in a really long time on myself so basically wherever i apply that gold i'm going to be applying this color right over it look at this pop Ugh. Like, are you kidding me do you see that see how freaking glittery this thing is if you ever want to intensify your eye makeup and make it look like very bam just buy one of these glitter and glows and oh my gosh it just it creates such a crazy pop to your eye this is basically the eyeshadow look part of it so what i'm gonna do now is i'm gonna finish this side of my eye and i'm also gonna be doing my eyeliner and my lashes by the way um reason why i skipped this is because i already made a tutorial on how to create that perfect like nice wing liner as well as how to apply lashes so if you're interested in that step just go ahead and click on the links in my description and it'll tell you exactly how to apply eyeliner and how to apply lashes on yourself and bam the lashes are on i'm going to be going in with that color oh by the way i also did apply already a, a nude liner right underneath just because i don't know lately i feel like within the past maybe like two three months i don't really put on dark like black liner in there anymore i used to do it all the time i'm going to go in and still smoke out the very bottom part of my eyes and i'm using that dark color that i used here in the corner i think it was called central park and i'm just gonna go ahead and blend it right underneath my eye And then using that blending brush that I used um, for that dark color, I'm gonna be going kind of like right over this. And now I'm just gonna be going on with some mascara. I'm using my L'Oreal Voluminous Lash Paradise. And then the last thing that I have to do are my lips. So I'm gonna do this very nice and bright uh, red lip by Anastasia. This is in the color American Doll. And I'm going to be using a very dark lip liner first. And it's gonna look like it doesn't match, but I'm really just gonna create a very pretty ombre look. I feel like this is the only way that I can personally really apply red because I am so like not a red person. But um, when done the right way, it can definitely happen really nicely. So this color is by MAC and it is called Chestnut. So once you are outlined like this, like a uh, chonga kind of look, <laughs> I'm just gonna do it towards the very edges too. All right, and now I'm gonna go ahead and apply my American Doll liquid lipstick. And I'm basically just applying it in the very corners first and then I'm gonna start blending it out little by little. Yeah, this is basically the completed look. Um, I know sometimes like with liquid lipsticks, like they tend to look a little shiny at first, um, but then they do dry down matte. That's when I feel like I can really pull out a red lip when it's matte. Can't do the really shiny ones, I have tried. And by mixing it with like this darker lip pencil, I feel like it kind of like makes it a little bit more wearable, if it makes any sense. I don't know, I, I feel like I can't just wear red plain and simple just like that. It doesn't fit me. I feel like it doesn't go well with my skin tone. So um, yeah. 
yeah this is basically it guys yay <laughs> this basically concludes my video for today I hope you guys um, got to learn something new um, I tried to make this as quick and easy as possible if you guys decide to do this look go ahead and comment down below I would love to see your look even if you want to tag me on Instagram oh my gosh that would be so awesome I know I have one more look possibly two more looks um, before Christmas but we shall see what timing looks like can you believe I still have like some shopping to do like <sighs> If you guys are new to my channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below and also turn on your notification bell. That way you're notified when I have uploaded. Also, don't forget to follow me on Instagram. It is at smashbrush underscore at the very end. I upload videos every Tuesdays and Thursdays. Give this video a thumbs up. Comment down below on anything that you would like to see next. And yeah, that is it, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you guys next time. Bye.